Crohn's disease is a type of inflammatory disease of the gastrointestinal tract. Symptoms include, pain of right abdomen is common initial symptom, diarrhea, may be bloody, fever, abdominal distension, and weight loss. Crohn disease may develop anywhere in the gastrointestinal tract from mouth to the large intestine. Crohn disease also affects fecal consistency and frequency. Fecal consistency may range from solid to watery depending on what part of the intestine is affected. In severe cases prominent diarrhea is exhibited, maybe more than 20 defecations during the day. Crohn disease also may cause bowel movement obstruction. Persistent vomiting and nausea is a sign of obstruction and intestinal stenosis. Perianal discomfort may also be prominent in Crohn's disease. Itchiness or pain around the anus may be suggestive of inflammation, fistulization or abscess around the anal area, or anal fissure. Perianal skin tags are also common in Crohn's disease, and may appear with or without the presence of colorectal polyps. The mouth may be affected by recurrent sores, aphthous ulcers. Many people with Crohn's disease have symptoms for years before the diagnosis. Many children are first diagnosed with Crohn's disease because of inability to maintain growth. Most commonly it occurs in teenagers but may occur at any age. Crohn disease is more common in whites than blacks, in Jews than non-Jews. Smoking is important risk factor. Almost two times more in smokers than non-smokers. Males and females are affected equally. Crohn disease etiology is not known. It means we don't know why it happens. Most commonly involves the terminal ileum and is discontinuous spread that may involve any part of the gastrointestinal tract. Characterized by transmural inflammation it means inflammation of the whole depth of bowel wall from mucosa to sarissa. The causes of Crohn's disease are unknown, but some combination of environmental, immune, and bacterial factors are included. Also, almost 50% is genetic predisposition. The immune system attacks the gastrointestinal tract it is not an autoimmune disease but immune response is important. Crohn's disease increases risk of colon cancer and small bowel cancer. Crohn's disease can lead to several mechanical complications within the intestines, including obstruction, fistulae, stricture and abscesses. Crohn disease, lumen and terminal ileum is narrow because of full thickness inflammation of the bowel wall. Diagnosis. Colonoscopy, endoscopy, capsule endoscopy, barium follow-through x-ray, are used for diagnosis. CT and MRI are used to diagnose of complications. Blood tests, erythrocyte sedimentation rate, ESR, and C-reactive protein help assess the degree of inflammation. Complete blood count may reveal anemia, which commonly is caused by blood loss leading to iron deficiency or by vitamin B12 deficiency. Sericyl adhesions from bowel to bowel also cause obstruction. Management. No treatment for Crohn disease. Only symptomatic treatment exists. Corticosteroid may be used for a brief period of time to rapidly improve symptoms. Stopping smoking is recommended in people with Crohn's disease. Checking for bowel cancer via colonoscopy is recommended every few years, starting eight years after the disease has begun. Lifestyle changes can reduce symptoms, including dietary adjustments, elemental diet, proper hydration, and smoking cessation. Acute treatment uses medications to treat any infection, normally antibiotics, and to reduce inflammation, normally aminosalicylate anti-inflammatory drugs and corticosteroids. Homeopathic preparations are not proven with this or any other condition, with large-scale studies finding them to be no more effective than a placebo. Crohn's disease is a chronic condition characterized by periods of improvement followed by episodes when symptoms flare up. With treatment, most people achieve a healthy weight, and the mortality rate for the disease is relatively low. It can vary from being benign to very severe, and people with CD could experience just one episode or have continuous symptoms. It usually reoccurs, although some people can remain disease-free for years or decades. Most people with Crohn's live a normal lifespan.